welcome back to Get The Gloss. So, actually, sorry, before I start, I just wanted to say, if you can hear a buzzing in the background, it's because the floor in my kitchen is being sanded. That's all it is, do not switch off. So, today I just wanna to talk to you about an exciting new range that's launched. It's getting quite a lot of press, and uh, there's quite a bit of buzz about it, and that is Rosie Huntington Whiteley's range for Marks and Spencers. It is a gorgeous makeup range, looks a bit like this, um, a lot of people have said there is a similarity in the look of it to Charlotte Tilbury's range, which we cannot lie, is true. However, because of the rose gold, etc. However, um, the theme behind Rosie's range is uh, girl on the go. Basically, it's all for women who live a fast paced, busy, hectic lifestyle, whether you're a mum, whether you work really hard, whether you work nights, whether you work days and nights, um, whether you've just got just tons going on, as we all have, uh, this is a range that is brilliant. She understands basically things that work and things that work fast. So there's a couple of things that I have been sent that I'm just gonna show you um, from the range, and the price point isn't ridiculous either. I've just, uh, I've got a list here of the prices. So basically the finishing powder, which I've got here, comes with a pot like this. Um, it's a translucent finishing powder and it's ultra fine and it's weightless and that's only 18 pounds. Things like this fantastic, amazing radiance cream, which gives this kind of glow, I'll show you in a second, um, is also 18 pounds. Lovely uh, palettes, different coloured palettes for eyeshadow. This is eyeshadow quad, 18 pounds. So it's really, really reasonable. Um, all the beautiful colours. And Rosie is the master, or mistress, as I should say, of um, that kind of really glowy, natural, slightly no makeup makeup, but a little bit glamorous look. And it's also been created by Intercos. And Intercos create makeup for all the massive um, makeup brands. And so it's really, really high quality. So I'm just gonna show you a couple of things. So, um, okay, I'm gonna start with, it's called Rosie for Autograph, by the way. Amazing Radiance Cream. You can buy it online, by the way, or you can buy it in store. I found it in my local uh, Banbury M&S the other day. Um, to be honest with you, I actually think that her underwear and this range is quite possibly the best things in M&S at the moment, um, apart from all the food, obviously. Um, not being rude to M&S, but I really do. It's really obviously a brilliant collaboration for them. So this cream, it has these kind of light reflecting particles in it, and it creates this real glowy um, finish to the skin without it looking greasy. I'm just, you can either add it after your moisturiser, or you can add it to your foundation, or you can add it just at spots of your face. I'm gonna add it to my cheeks to give them a bit of a glow. Sorry, I'm a little bit far away today. And it creates this sort of luminosity, I hope you can see that, um, that doesn't look sort of fake, it looks really real. And it's obvious that Rosie's sort of taken inspiration from all the, um, the big makeup ranges and everything that the big makeup artists are doing at the moment. So it's all about radiance, glow, natural contouring, sort of slightly pushing the boundaries of your face. I think it's brilliant. Okay, I'm just gonna use um, a bit of this. This is called the Retoucher and it's actually from Charlotte Tilbury. It's not from Rosie's, but in order to go to the next thing, I'm just gonna add this. This is a great product. I use it all over my face for um, under the eyes, around the nose, for getting rid of redness. It's really great. So then we have got this, which is called, this is from Rosie's range, translucent finishing powder. Um, this is like some other ones I've seen on the market, but this is less expensive version, to be honest, which is great. It's very, very fine powder, can be used for all skin tones. Also, smells really lovely, it smells sort of fresh. Um, so I apply it around the nose, under the eyes, um, one thing I've always been taught by makeup artists is to leave the cheek area because that's the bit that needs to glow. So 
a lovely cheek area. Um, right, I'm going to add a little bit of bronzer. This is my own bronzer. Um, just because... Oh, whoops. So I've got a mascara on at the moment. I'm not going to name it, but it goes everywhere. Uh, it's going in the bin. Right, a little bit of bronzer, because I know Rosie loves the bronze look, but I haven't got the bronzer in the range. But she clearly, obviously, does do bronzers. Okay, my, this bronzer, by the way, is Kiko Perfecting Bronzer. Really like it. Kiko, inexpensive, but brilliant range. Okay, so what I was going to show you was this lovely palette here. It's called the Eyeshadow Palette in Deco Diamonds. Now, you can use different parts of the palette to create different looks. You can create a very soft, pale, greeny colour, or you can mix them together for a very sort of soft, nude look. Or this brown, deep brown, with no shimmer, is uh, for something a little more intense. I'm going to use this shade to cover the lids for a sort of natural colour. Right, can you see that? Just to give a bit of subtle definition. Then I'm going to use this darker shade here, just to go nearer to the lash line. Just create a bit of something a little more full on. And, and this highlighter here can be used on the insides of the eye, on the um, brow bone, just to bring the eyes out a little bit, just to sort of define them a bit more. And I'm actually going to also maybe add See, if I add a little bit of this greeny colour, let me see what happens then. So if you add the greeny colour, it sort of like makes it look a bit more grey, which is also very pretty. So that's that. Um, another thing I love from the range are these. Probably some of my favourite things in the range. They are creamy eyeshadow sticks. Let me look at my list. They are creamy eyeshadow sticks, £12.50. Really, really good for that price. And they basically are a shimmery stick for the eyes. Um, come in lots of different shades. I love this one, this is my favourite. It is, can't see the colour, but anyway, it is a sort of bronzed shade. And this one here is a lovely, lovely silver, sort of silvery taupe. Um, so I'm gonna use the bronze shade also on the tops of my lids, just to add a little bit of shimmer and a bit more definition. I have a feeling this is going to be a colour that Rosie would probably use herself. Um, so you can use that above and below, and you have a few minutes to sort of rub it in, but then it does set. It does set, and it does really, really last all day. I've been wearing them to work, out in the evenings, etc, etc. And that is all I have from the range at the moment, but I really would highly recommend it. I'm just going to finish it off with a, a bit of this lip gloss. It's from Gola and it's like a, um, just a pearl lip colour. But yeah, I would highly recommend the range. Um, I think it's really good value for money and very, very, very modern, very now. So I hope you like this. Don't forget to subscribe to Get The Gloss TV and I'll see you very soon. Bye.